Hey guys, you with me, Kevin, your scuba professional, and today we're here to have a quick look at the Tusa Platina snorkeling set that we've got available on our site. This is an adult set for snorkeling, and it's got a few funky things on the go. First off, I see it comes this really great snorkeling carry bag. So it's got a nylon top section over there, it's got this ribbed or caged mesh section at the bottom, so any wet stuff that gets in there will drain out while you're walking around the beach, you don't have to bring wet things back to the hotel room. You've got a funky little handle at the top, and a really comfy little shoulder strap over there, and it's got a U-shaped zip for you to get in and out of it really, really easily. So you could put, you can see, as we take this out over here, you fit your mask, fins and snorkel in there quite easily, you also get your towel, your costume, a few other funky things, so great little beach bag over there as well. Just gonna move back out the top. And then here is the mask itself. So let's just pull this up. Plastic. Ugh. Ugh. So we'll open this up and take it away. Why is there so much plastic? This will be recycled. Okay. Get it out of the recycle. Okay, so let's have a look at the mask and the snorkel and the fins. Let's start with the snorkel, then jump to the fins. So the snorkel, standard uh, Tusa snorkel, you have a splash protector up at the top, you've got a snorkel retainer over here, and you've got a ergo bite, comfy, ergonomically designed mouthpiece over there with a one-way one valve at the bottom. So if any water or waves hit the top of the snorkel, it's not a dry snorkel, but uh, it does have a splash guard to reduce the amount of water that gets in, and any small amount of water will go right to the bottom and just drain out, making it super easy for you to clear. And it's obviously ergonomic designed and bent just to, to bend around the side of your head. The Tusa Platina mask over here is one of Tusa's standard dive masks. It's quite popular in the, the Maris, uh, sorry, in the no, Tusa. <laughs> oh, where's a Maris? Do you know that Maris and Tusa are the same company in South Africa? That's why I mentioned that. But yeah, the Tusa Platina mask is really, really popular within the Tusa range. So uh, a lot of scuba divers use this mask as well. So it's a twin lens design and it sits quite close to your face, which means you get a really big field of vision. It does have a very, very, very thin section over the top of the nose over here to separate the lenses, but when you put it on, you can hardly see it at all. And it's got quite a, it sits quite comfy on your face and down around the cheek area, it gives a lot of peripheral vision when you've got it on. The nose pocket over here is quite soft and easy to pinch if you're going to go duck diving down if you're snorkeling and on a scuba dive. And it has a double sealed design at the top over here. The double seal means there's a seal on the outside and the inside which goes a long way to reduce leakage as far as the mask is concerned. Top tip from me with any snorkeling mask, if you've got it on you find it's leaking, always a good idea to loosen the mask and readjust. If you tighten it you just collapse the mask in on itself and that's not ideal. You can see that double seal system over there needs to be nice and loose on your face. It's a silicone strap at the back over here, fits nice and big over the crown of your head and you have a lift clip over here which you can lift up to loosen and then it's quite easy just to pull it and tighten it so it's super easy to adjust and there is some travel on this uh, arm over the side of the mask just as far as the straps concerned to distribute weight and it comes with this really great little set of travel snorkeling fins these aren't ideal for scuba diving but for a good little snorkel around the ocean they're really really cool they're in the lagoons so it's a short little paddle type fin it is made out of a it is made of a molded plastic polymer so it's got a uh, the polymer and the plastic built in so it does give you some flex when you're swimming on and it's got lots of drain holes over the top you wear this barefoot you don't have to wear it with booties if you can fit a little booty in good for you but you can wear it barefoot and it's got quite a soft silicone strap at the back and you can adjust that with another lift clip you can loosen it over there so this is quite adjustable just as far as shoe sizes are concerned you can see over here they say it's a size 4 to size 9 so you can wear this from a size 4 foot all the way up to a size 9 so it's super super adjustable and it comes in the left foot and the right foot. In fact, it's omnifootical, left and right and right and left. So you really have to worry which, uh, which foot you put it on. But these are great for a good little paddle around if you're looking at interesting fish off the backs of boats and piers and uh, off the beach itself. So there's the review of the Tusa Platina snorkeling set. Comes with this great little set of travel snorkeling fins. The Platina mask itself, which is a dive standard in the Tusa range, super comfy for snorkeling and scuba, and this really awesome snorkel with the splash protector and one-way valve. If you guys are enjoying the product reviews, please feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Go over there and give that a click, subscribe to us, and we'll keep you up to date with all the latest reviews that we've got with all this really cool scuba gear that's available in the world today. You can also go check out our social streams, the main one being facebook.com forward slash scuba.co.za. 
keep you up to date with all our trips and travels and other funky things that we do. So that's it from me, guys. And I look forward to seeing you really soon in the water.